quick and intense shadow boxing workout for stamina, no equipment needed. Here we go. First, you're going to warm up with 300 jumping jacks. Yes, I said 300 jumping jacks. Now, I love doing jumping jacks. It reminds me of jumping rope. When you do them in high reps, 300 straight, your calves are going to be burning. Everything's going to be burning. It's a very great full body workout that'll help to get the body warmed up. And the thing that I compare it to is jumping rope. So 300 jumping jacks, as you can see, I like to turn here, turn there. It doesn't have to be 300 nice form straight. You can do it however you want to. This will really help to open up your mind to movement so i'll face this way i'll face that way i'll move a little more down i'll bounce here bounce there look around for these 300 jumping jacks the name of the game is just to get the blood flowing all throughout the body now as you notice i am in a dugout this workout you can do anywhere never let your surroundings you not have any equipment stop you from becoming your best self as you can see, like I said, I'm in the dugout, very limited space, but I'm still going to get it done. Hopefully this video will inspire you that you can get it anywhere in the dugout. You can go in your bathroom, just look in the mirror. You can hit this workout literally in your bathroom, just staring at the mirror, hitting the jumping jacks, and you're going to do the shadow boxing. Dude, you can do this anywhere, but I like to do it outside, getting some sun. I'll take my shirt off, really get some sun on the skin. That really helps to boost the testosterone, the mentality, so you can be a savage. So here we go, 300, wiping the sweat, going and going. Right after that, you're going to go into 15 minutes of free flow shadow boxing. Nothing complicated. Now, as you can see, I have very limited space because I'm in a dugout. Still, I can work my movement. When you work shadow boxing, in very confined spaces this really helps you to tighten up your game for the inside game moving on your feet and really being aware of your surroundings so 15 minutes in the dugout just moving and grooving and flowing pivoting in this little tight and confined space if this is a little hard for you that's okay get used to working in these tight spots and really pivoting and moving while you know just being right there in the thick of things and that's how you do it quick and intense 15 minute savage shadow boxing workout try it out let me know how it goes and always remember train hard and be kind